Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell, I'm not in my house, but it may look familiar. I am house sitting again for Bambi. She went out of town with her husband, and so we are house slash pup sitting. I've done this before. If you go back and look at my other vlogs, you'll see the previous house sitting. I hope you're excited for a whole week of vlogging house sitting content. Uh, today is day one of house sitting. I came in, I put my stuff away already. Well, away as in I put it down somewhere. I sat here and I chilled with the pups for a little bit. We watched some TV and then I realized that I don't have any food or breakfast items like for dinner or for breakfast. I do have vegan fried rice for lunch. I can't eat that for every meal. We are going to have to go to a store and get some kind of temporary groceries. I don't want to go to like our fries or Kroger store. I'm there all week long because of, you know, my job being near there. I think I'm going to try and go to this new store that just opened called Aldi, um, but I know it's popular in other places. Um, I know we have a few throughout the valley now, so I haven't been there yet, and I've heard it's like a discount store. It's not like a dollar store, but it's like a discount store. I want to go there and see like what's in there anyways. Down the street, I think I'm going to go try that out. Um, Probably not going to bring my camera with me because it is hot outside and I don't want to leave you in the car. But I will bring my phone and I will record on that. So, uh, quality shift will probably happen, but yeah. So, um, let's go to Aldi, see what I can get, and I'll come back and do a little haul for you guys. Hi guys. Um, so we are in the car. You are on my phone now. We made it. Oh, you can't see the logo from here, but we're at Aldi. We're gonna go inside and see what I can get for tonight. Um, cause I'm actually gonna do a real shop tomorrow or Peyton's gonna do one for me tomorrow. So I only need stuff for tonight and like tomorrow morning before I go to work. I was gonna wear this mask, but then I realized that I took the elastic off this one. So I guess, even though it's early, we're gonna be spooky. Um, because, you know, be safe. I'm still vaccinated, but you gotta be extra safe. Go inside. Um, I might try to record a little bit. A little bit. Um, I'm not sure how much I'll get, but let's go inside and see what we can find. <laughs> So, temptation one. I <laughs> said I wasn't gonna go to Starbucks, but I was too tempted. Mm. Um, this is a grande matcha green tea, or, or this is a venti matcha green tea latte with coconut milk and two pumps of chai. It's been a recent favorite. We got that. Um, I wanted to show you guys what I got at Aldi. First of all, paper bags. Paper bags say Aldi on them. They charged me for this bag. At least this paper. Anyways, so first off, I got oat milk. It was cheap, <laughs> and um, I decided to give it a shot this week instead of the regular almond milk I use. Next, oh, I got this Celsius drink because people keep telling me to try them, and this one is kiwi guava, so I might like it. I got bagels, bagels for breakfast. These were like a dollar or something, I think. Let me find my receipt. Hold on. I found it. The oat milk was two ninety nine, which is decent for non dairy milk. The Celsius drink was a dollar eighty eight. I don't know how much these are normally. I'll put that on the screen because I'm not sure. Bagels. These guys were $1.49. Not bad for six bagels. So with the bagels, I got Happy Farms Chive and Onion Cream Cheese Spread. I normally get like 
the on-brand version, but this is the version they had, and it's like bigger than the other one. This is eight ounces still, but it's like a bigger container. $1.49. Um, so we're gonna get that a shot with our bagels. And I got these sugar-free mints that are sour. Uh, there's green apple, watermelon, and tangerine. Uh, these were $1.85, which is a little high for mints. But um, according to TikTok on the mental health area, this is good for when you are like driving or like you feel like you're having like a panic attack or something. It's just something to stimulate like a different sensation other than what's going on. So I'm going to keep these in my car um, for those times that I'm stressed out in my car. And that is bag number one. All right. We got iced coffee. Um, I've been drinking this at home a lot. I normally get the cold brew uh, version. They didn't have cold brew there. They had this one or they had a like, vanilla latte. But the vanilla latte had way too much milk in it. So I got this unsweetened medium roast and try it out. Last time I got the blonde one and the blonde was much more appealing to me. We also got Black Forest Gummies. Um, this one was $5.59, but it's a thick box. And um, there is 36 pouches in here. I got, I'm assuming these were Ritz crackers, alternative brand. Golden, no, vegetable round crackers. There's one that said golden round crackers. This one's vegetable round crackers. Um, made with real vegetables. I go through Ritz crackers like crazy. It's like my snack food is <laughs> Ritz crackers. So I got these ones to tide me over when I'm feeling snacky when I'm sitting here editing. So Ritz crackers, but not Ritz crackers. Last but not least, um, they didn't have like a lot of dinner options, like easy dinners, like microwavable things and stuff. They had like a few things here and there, like they had like a pulled pork thing, they had like a beef thing, a chicken thing. So to make my life easy today, before I go on my official shopping trip, I got this. Macaroni and cheese. Now, Bambi, if you're watching this, and I know you are, this is not going to go on any of your dishes, it's going to stay in this container. But um, it's really easy, I just have to put it in the microwave and it'll be done. Um, because I don't feel like cooking, and, um, tomorrow I'll go on my actual shopping trip and get, like, actual meals. So tonight is mac and cheese. Um, tomorrow will be better. That's bag number two. This is what we got for the first time shopping there. I think I did pretty good. Um, like I said, it was, like, 20 bucks for all of this. Paper bags are 10 cents each. So that's not bad. These are big, big paper bags, too. And they can be recycled. 100% recyclable, it says it on the back. So I'm gonna put these away real quick. And I think that's gonna be it until bedtime. So I'm gonna go edit some stuff. And I'll see you guys in a bit.